72% of children being born in African American communities to single parents is a frightening number. Daniel Patrick Monahan in his report said that 29% of African American children being born into out of wedlock households was a travesty. So if 29% is a travesty in 1965, what is 72% in 2013? I wish I had had a father who was around and involved in that. My name is Wanda Chapman. I'm a single mom of three children. Being a single mom is not easy at all. Did you do your homework? Single parenthood as a notion was not really present pre-colonization and pre-slavery. African men took care of their children. We haven't been to Africa in a long time. Most African Americans don't know much about Africa. What are women looking for when a mate? They're looking for all the wrong things and are accepting less and less because the norms are telling them they're entitled to less and less. I think it's problematic when our young people see our celebrities father multiple children with multiple women. The government is taking a version of taking care of their children from the black man. The government is the daddy of the family. The court acts for 17% of your income. So the father should have a minimum of 17% of the child's time. Honestly, I really think it should be 50% of the time. If you have laws that encourage people on welfare to not have a man in the home, then guess what? People on welfare are not going to have a man in the home. People who blame the government to say, well, the government is trying to hold me down, those are people who just talk a lot of crap. It's about getting up every day in that house, showing how to respect a mother, showing how to live, showing work ethic, all of those things you teach on a daily basis, and that can't be done piecemeal. It's a pretty disturbing epidemic. It is beyond catastrophic. It's a crisis. It's devastating. The 72% number. 72%? 72%. 72%.